Kia ora koutou katoa, ko John Whanga tōku ingoa, no Ngāti Rākai Pāka, no Ngāti Kahununu, no Ngāti Ronga Mai Wahine Ahau. Ko au te kai hautu tuarua mo te hauora Māori ki te manatū hauora. E ai ki te kōrero o ngā mātua, ko te pai tawhiti whāia kia tata, ko te pai tata whakamaua kia tina. Ko tātou katoa kei te whāia ngā pai tawhiti ki pai ora. Ko te whāinga matua, ko te oranga tonu tango o te iwi, o ti rā, ko te pūāwai tanga o ngā whānau. Nā reira, kia kaha, kia maia, kia manawanui, Māori ora. I'm delighted to be part of the second Te Aorere Kura National Hui and have the opportunity to share some information on how we are supporting the implementation of actions in the Te Aorere Kura Action Plan as well as wider health-led initiatives contributing to family violence and sexual violence prevention and response. Family violence and sexual violence is a key determinant of health and has significant health and well-being impacts on individuals, whānau and communities, especially Māori. The health system has key roles and responsibilities in addressing family violence and sexual violence. In addition to the role the health workforce plays in identifying and responding to family violence and sexual violence, the health sector's contribution comes through keeping whānau well, so that stresses that can trigger or contribute to violence are avoided. You will be aware of the very significant health sector reforms that have been and are continuing to be implemented. At the heart of these reforms, is implementing a population health approach, ensuring Māori whānau and consumer voices are firmly embedded in decision making and that the system is equitable for everybody. Our vision is that all New Zealanders achieve pai ora, healthy futures. Achieving pai ora means that people and whānau will live longer in good health, have improved health and quality of life, are part of healthy, inclusive and resilient communities and live in environments that sustain their well-being. The role of our health system is to put in place the services, initiatives and partnerships to protect, promote and improve health and well-being, achieve equity and provide pai order. The pai order strategies will set the health system direction over the next five to ten years. Addressing the socio-economic determinants of health including family violence and sexual violence, will be an important part of this. This means working collaboratively, not just Manatū Hawora, Te Whatu Ora and Te ora, but with other agencies and local communities to integrate community-led responses, whether it's to eliminate family and sexual violence, or more broadly, to address the wider determinants of health and achieve pai ora, healthy futures for everyone. It's imperative that we work together the health sector with other agencies, with communities, to achieve this. It will take time, and we are learning and making improvements as we progress this important mahi. Te Aorerekura sets a wellbeing and strengths-based vision, with a strong focus on primary prevention, healing, and the critical role of tangata whenua and community leadership for achieving intergenerational change. This aligns well with the intent of the locality and regional planning underway as part of the health and disability system reforms. The health reforms aim to enable the health sector to be better set up to prevent and respond to family violence and sexual violence and achieve Te Aorerekura's objectives. For example, the planned localities approach aims to foster community-led solutions that make a difference to the wider social, behavioural, economic and environmental determinants of health. This will support a more joined up whole of system response to collectively improve community hauora outcomes with iwi, whānau Māori and communities by addressing the wider determinants of health. An example is Action 24 of Te Aorerekura, which is a cross-agency action to test the feasibility of a relational commissioning model for early years primary child health and maternal mental health services in South Auckland. In other words, taking a more joined up approach than in the past. The objective of this two year action led by Te Whatuora was to establish and test 
the feasibility of a co-commissioning model of early years primary child health and maternal mental health services together with social services in South Auckland, leveraging off the place-based initiative. This included supporting a holistic approach to providing early years services to whānau to explore ways of linking family violence and sexual violence prevention approaches with services being provided to families in the first 1,000 days. Under this action, we've tested how we could transition the Start Well program in South Auckland from a centrally funded initiative to a cross-agency funded one. This has been a good way of seeing how co-commissioning would work because we've been able to test it on a small scale. It's early days yet as this important mahi is evolving, but this approach has already demonstrated the value in having a forum of agencies and established and effective relationships in communities so that we can achieve more integrated, community-led responses. We will be able to apply these learnings as we work together to eliminate family violence and sexual violence and also more broadly as we work to deliver health services that provide equitable access and coverage. There's a lot of work underway to help achieve that. As our new operating model for the health sector takes hold and our strategies to achieve paiora are implemented, we will increasingly see better integration of community-led responses and greater collaboration when it comes to commissioning of services and solutions. Key to this is working more closely with tangata whenua and communities and honouring our commitments to te tiriti o waitangi. Working more closely together and learning as we go will help us work towards the elimination of family violence and sexual violence and also more broadly assist with the provision of health services that provide equitable access and coverage and enable pai ora. We are very committed to playing our part in this work and in te aurerekura. We also recognise that collaboration is key and look forward to continuing our work with you all. Thank you again for your commitment and actions to support this important journey so far. Nā reira, mā koutou, mā tātou, ka tutuki. Tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā tātou katoa.